Hey everyone, now I will show you how we prepare CBSC content notes in our lab. Welcome to Nanomaterial Lab at IICR Pune. The idea of our group is to develop functional inorganic materials using solution process nanocrystalline modules. We will do the reaction using a sink line under inert nitrogen gas atmosphere. To prepare organic cap CBSC, we are following this paper by Mori Saito. All the reagents have been taken in a 3 net class. Nitrogen gas is on. Wait for some time so that nitrogen gas pours out all the air from the flask. Now put the septum. Set the temperature to 90 degrees centigrade. The instrument has been calibrated, so 90 degrees centigrade means 96 degrees centigrade in this instrument. See the temperature is increasing. Now the temperature is 90 degree centigrade. So what we will do now, we will take acid. This will remove even trace amount of oxygen and water content dissolved in the reagents. So we will apply vacuum for 5 minutes and nitrogen gas for 2 minutes alternatively. We will do this for 3-4 times. We are done with degassing. Now it's time to put in high temperature. We'll set the temperature to 320 degrees Celsius. Here I am increasing till 220 degrees centigrade. After it reaches 220, I will set 320 again. In high temperature, all the capping agents bind cadmium and everything becomes soluble. That will take about half an hour. Meanwhile, we will prepare selenium solution in top in this globus. Solution is clear now, so we can inject selenium picker cells. Let's take out selenium solution.
we are using a thick needle to facilitate fast injection. You know this process gives us a precise control over size. See, we are injecting cold selenium solution into hot cadmium precursor. This instantly gives a sudden burst of nucleation. But in a moment, temperature goes down. So no new nucleus can form, whereas the rest of the monomers can be added to the already formed nuclei and the nuclei grows. Thus, we can separate the nucleation and growth process combined with the subsequent diffusion control growth process through which the crystal size is determined. We can see the noise change in color. This happens for quantum quantization effect, you might know. As the reaction proceeds, the size of the nanocrystal grows. Hence, we see a red shift in emission peak. So, color changes accordingly. Reaction is done. Now stop eating. And let it cool. At around 100 degrees centigrade, add turbo into quench the reaction. Hence, I prepared good quality PDSE quantum dots as reflected in absorbance and PL measurements. 